Microsoft has just dropped Cosmos 2.5 model. This model is a multimodal literate model for machine reading of text intensive images. Let me show you an example of the image it can OCR. So if you look at this image, this is quite a complex image with a lot of rich text. There are bullet points, there are tables, there are some cryptic text and we can also appreciate that, for example, if you have PDF documents consist of, consisting of text images with tabular data, then it becomes quite hard even for these vision models to decipher the text. But Microsoft says that this model has been fine-tuned or trained especially for these use cases. This model Cosmos 2.5 is trained on large-scale text-intensive images. Cosmos 2.5 excels in two distinct yet cooperative transcription tasks. First, generating spatially aware text blocks where each block of text is assigned its spatial coordinates within the image. And secondly, producing structured text output that captures style and structures into the markdown format. This unified multimodal literate capability is achieved through a shared decoder only autoregressive transformer architecture also with task specific prompts and flexible text representation they have also evaluated this cosmos 2.5 on end to end document level text recognition and image to markdown text generation the model can be readily adapted for any text intensive image understanding task with different prompts to supervise fine tuning making it a general purpose tool for real world applications involving text rich images also it can be used to scale future multimodal large language models also microsoft has open source the checkpoint and inference code of cosmos 2.5 you can get this inference code from uh, their github repo which you can access from here from the model card at hugging face and i will drop the link to it in video description now these are all the good things let's check at the downside first downside very hard to install locally i have tried it a lot but it doesn't simply get installed the reason being that it primarily works with flash attention too so it only runs on ampere add or hopper gpu so it means a100 h100 maybe rtx 3090 4090 and that's it i have tried it on my nvidia rtx a6000 it doesn't work also flash attention 2 is quite hard to install without um you know going through a lot of pain because it requires a lot of dependency and stuff so you would need to git clone this github repo you can access it from here and then once you go into that you would need to go to the specific cosmos 2 directory from there you would need to install all of these requirements and there are a lot of them but i'm more than sure you're going to face a lot of trouble with this and with this flash attention especially as i was mentioning you would need to have that uh, ampere add or hopper gpus so that is a bit of a shame that model size is just 6 gig why would microsoft make it so hard to do these prerequisites so anyway i'm uh, still looking if i could be able to run it through some um, transformers library or through vllm i'm going to share it in the uh, channel later on but all in all i like the model the models uh, especially the way it is targeted towards these text intensive images because i believe that is really required um and this trend of small but specialized ai model is really good and it sort of it feel closer to how the human brain operates because we are not just using one big monolithic neural net or model uh, but rather we are getting these models specifically we earlier we saw florence model which was amazing and such a breeze to get it installed and use hopefully microsoft also um, would try to make it easier to run and because if you go to the model card you don't see any transformer code as of yet and to be fair to them it has just been released few hours ago i think i i'm just working on the bleeding edge here so maybe i will check back in a few days to see if they have ported it to vllm or to transformers as soon as they do we will have a look again but anyway um if you have access to those gpu card <clears throat> feel free to 
follow that repo and then let us know how, how you go if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps thanks for watching